Hey yo, what's going on? It's Sherrick here and it is time for another one of these. It's the 1st of January 2017 and uh, aptly it is Origins. That's the theme for this month. Haven't looked into it as the usual. Very excited to see what's getting into it. I am a little uh, bummed that we are out of the year of t-shirts though. So probably, I, I don't know, we might get a t-shirt in this box. I have no idea. But I'm not going to talk too much. I'm just going to open it up. Yeah, there's an S. There's a Superman there. We do get a t-shirt. Awesome. Um, I'm going to go right into the t-shirt to start. It looks like this, the original since 1981 Mario shirt. Going to model it for you like I always do. That's a really cool shirt. Looks like it's pretty decent quality. Um, very excited about that. I mean, what can you say? It's Mario. Like, um, as a side note, I'm very excited about the Nintendo Switch, even though I didn't get my pre-order in in time. Um, but that's neither here nor there. So, cool shirt. Very excited about it thus far. Next thing that's in here is a, a Donatello mini tiki mug. That's kind of cool. Yeah, there it is, right there. It is, um, it is a, you know, it's, it's a little... A little more, like, for lack of better words, it's a little more high quality than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to look just kind of like, like it was going to be like a plastic kind of, well, look kind of like on the box there. I thought it was going to be kind of like plasticky, but it is definitely a ceramic mug. Um, no handle or, of any sort, but it's a nice little decoration. You can probably put, like, pencils and stuff in there. But that's really cool. I like that a lot. I was a big Ninja Turtles fan growing up. Oh, I've noticed, um, if you look real close, you can see the D right there for Donatello. On his belt. So that'll go right there. What else is in here? Ha ha! A Captain America the First Avenger 1940s scaled replica shield. And there you have that. <laughs> and it's got a uh, Captain America cir circa 1940 on the back. A little bit of a. Uh, looks like Chris Evans is Steve Rogers. Uh, but. This is from efxcollectibles.com, so there's that as well. Um, let's see here. It, it looks it has an uh, authenticity card, and yeah, it's got the shield as well. So I'm gonna get to the card first. So there's your on the back. It says an official prop replica by EFX, created from the original original master pole. Oh, Original master molds, patterns, digital files, and reference from Marvel Studios archives. It is manufactured with the highest quality materials, etc. Et and then it's got here's the shield itself, and it has the handholds in the back, which I think are very cool. It's a, it's very, I mean, it's a metal shield for sure. Cool. Looks like it's got a stand of some sort. It's a plastic piece. It's this marble opponent, and it is taped shut. There we go. We got it out of that casing. So I believe it would sit something. It looks like it attaches in here somehow. Like this. There's more in here though. To make me believe that it's like on a stand. Yeah, it's on a stand. So here's the stand itself. And it says Captain America's 1940s shield. EFX and Marvel. And so once you sit that in there, I believe this slots in to the base. It does indeed. Uh, da, very nice. That it's um, it's only kind of just sitting in that stand. By the way, it's not like fastened securely. So if you wanted to take it out, you could. So, but also don't think that it's just gonna like just sit in there and be secure. Cause it, I mean, it probably won't fall over if you like bump your dresser or your table or wherever it's sitting. But I don't think that it would um sit in there if it was rattled for too much. Okay, let's see. There is number one, Action Comics. Hmm, I wonder what that could be about. 
Certificate of Authenticity. It's an authentic reprint of Action Comics number one featuring the first appearance of Superman. The special edition reprint is exclusive to Loot Crate. Check that out. I don't, honestly, I don't want to open this because, uh, I mean, even though it is a reprint, this is really cool to have. Like, you could just be like, yeah, this is the number one for, uh, for first appearance of Superman. Uh, I might open it, but for now, I think I'm going to leave it in, the, in in the plastic. I think that's really cool. Um, and what else is in here? There is, of course, the pin, and it is a TMNT logo pin. That really, I, I honestly, like, I want to, like, put it on, like, a bag or something, but I'm afraid I would, like, fall off at some point. But that's really cool. I like that. Yeah, the logo looks really nice. Obviously, this is 2017 for Origins. It's going to go up with the rest of my pins, which I might actually do a video showing what's up there. And so I've got all 12. I've got 24 pins up there, plus two for, well, now 25, and then the two from the wrestling crates. That's really cool. And uh, finally, we're going to go in here and see the Origins comic. Now, they've kind of, um... oh, that's really cool. This crate turns into a comic book holder. That is very nice. I like it when they do stuff like that, when they actually do something with the crate. Um, here's the shield. There's a brief history of what the shield looked like. Okay, let's see. Let's see. What else is in here? There's ex muglet horoscopes. So there's all, they've got all of them plus shredder. That's cool. I want to see what the, um, they've got the, whoa, 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 what was that? The Risky Business Bundle. Interesting. All right, let's see. I want to see what the, what the Mega Crate, et cetera, is. Mass Effect Andromeda coming soon to Loot Crate. There's also a thing. Um, but that's not what we're here for. Where is our info on the Mega Crate? Ha, there it is. So it's got the uh, Ninja... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles original series collector edition DVD set in the uh, in there. Um, a Superman figurine, an iPad Pro, a retro bit twin gaming system, full scale shield replica for Captain America, and Super Mario's Monopoly. And the Mega Crate will have a backpack and Mario Uno. That is a very interesting. It also highlights the WWE Slam Crate, which will be coming in. Uh, not, not not February, but March. So that, that'll be there. And that's going to do it. This is a really good crate. A lot of, like, everything in this crate that I liked. I mean, it's a stark contrast from the uh, the uh, crate that I got last month, um, where I wasn't really a fan of the stuff that was in it. This is, this is like a complete 180. I'm a fan of everything that was in here. It's all really cool stuff. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Um, subscribe and share if you feel so inclined. It lets me know what you guys like to see. It really helps me out. I know everyone says that, but it really helps me out what, if you subscribe and share. Let other people know that uh, you like what I'm doing. And of course, I will see you right here on this channel for the next one. Peace!